Okay, it's the 10th of April. I've just finished my morning training session uh, here at Ponds Forge. Diving's going a little bit better, starting to recover from my back injury now. So moving forward, I'm still a long way from where I want to be, but I'll keep you informed. Uh, the reason why I'm in my Olympic track suit is because I'm about to head up to a school in Sheffield. A friend of mine's son, who's seven years old, I'm going in to see the whole of Y3. Uh, I've got my Olympic medal in my pocket, I've got some autograph cards, and uh, tell them a bit about the Olympics and try and inspire them to get a bit more active, because a lot of them in the school apparently aren't that keen on sport. So, doing my thing, and I'll uh, try and take some footage to let you know how I get on. Who's seen the top diving board at Pond's Forge? Okay, does anybody know how high that diving board is in metres? Ten. Correct. Now, ten metres doesn't sound very high, does it? You think? Ten metres. Okay, who here knows how high a double-decker bus is? Yeah? So everyone's got a picture of a double-decker bus? Yeah, that's pretty high, isn't it? Yeah? Now imagine another double-decker bus on top of that. Okay? And then imagine a car on top of that. That's 10 metres high. Now who here fancies doing what I have to do, which is balance on your tiptoes backwards on the 10 metre board? <laughs> do you? Well, great, you see. Now when I ask that question to adults, they all go, oh no, definitely not. I don't think your teachers would no way. Uh, that. <laughs> I do. Right up on your tiptoes. But sometimes I have to stand backwards. Sometimes I have to stand forwards. Sometimes I even have to do a handstand. <laughs> now I've got, I think I've got a video clip on here, which I'll try and play for you of me doing a handstand. Would you like to see that? Yeah! Okay, so I'm, I'm back from Landside, uh, Landside School. I had 64 seven and eight year olds. I was there for about 45 minutes and uh, tried to show them a few videos, but they didn't work, but it didn't matter anyway, because I had fired loads of questions at me. Um, just trying to think, some of my favorites were, have you ever hit your head on the bottom and does it hurt? And probably one of the most bizarre ones, how fast can you run? So I asked the girl, well, how fast can you run? And then we ended up uh, organising a race. So I might have to go back there for sports day in a few weeks. But uh, yeah, great, day, great way to spend the afternoon and uh, back to training now.